Welcome back. We are now going to define task list usage keys. These keys are used to specify all the categories and task lists that are used in a work center. To customize usage keys, we go to SPRO, then to IMG, we scroll down to Plant Maintenance and Customer Service, then to Maintenance Plants, Work Centers, Task Lists, and PLTs. We then go to Work Centers, then to Task List Data, and finally to Define Task List Usage Keys. So we go ahead and open that. And now we have a list of available usage keys. It's quite a long list, but we are going to select 004. The two commonly used ones are 004 and 009. That is maintenance task lists and all task list types. You still can go ahead and select any of the others depending on your application. So in our case, we're going to select 004. So we go ahead and highlight it, then go to task list types. So at the top here, we have our usage key, again, which is 004, and that is maintenance task lists. So I have already assigned a few task list types which are under this usage key. The first one is A which is general task list. The second one is E which is equipment task list and the third one is functional location, ta functional location task list. One thing that we need to remember is that each of the work centers that we create has to be assigned a task list. So that is the reason we needed to create this so that we can be able to assign it to a work center. So that is how we create task lists and we shall see how it's used later on in uh, upcoming videos. So we can go ahead and save depending on the changes that we have made. So we're going to move on to the next video where we're going to learn how to maintain control key. These are keys that are used to define the business functions that an operation will have as it goes through the process. So we, we are going to see how that is set up. So thank you for watching and see you in the next video.